हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल माय नेम इज़ प्रियंद्र कुमार एंड टुडे वी विल लर्न हाउ टू यूज स्पार्क लाइंस इन माइक्रोसॉफ्ट एक्सेल सो फ्रेंड्स वी यूज्ड स्पार्क लाइंस इन बीआई डैशबोर्ड्स और सम अदर डैशबोर्ड्स वेयर वेयर इन वी डोंट हैव दिस सफिशेंट स्पेस टू क्रिएटिंग द ग्राफ सो आई एम जस्ट क्रिएटिंग सम डमी डेटा for date first april to fifth april nco which is net call offered nch which is net call handled and sl percentage which is service level percentage okay so i am creating some random number for nco rand between 100 comma 120 so i am creating random number between 100 and 120 similarly for the nch i am creating rand between uh, 80 to 100 okay just fill it right and create random number for service level also service level percentage is between 70 to 100 so i'm just taking the random number okay select the Data copy paste special value select entire column so just auto fit it okay so make the data format color header color and border okay we will use spark line on column G two spark line okay so let me format it. interior color font color or we can change another color this one just remove the grid lines okay so data is formatted now we will use the spark line here so we will go to the insert tab and we will select spark line will not take any graph here so spark line does not take much space so i'll use the first line so in date range will give the nco data and location will be g2 g2 click okay spark line is ready just drag it down okay so now spark line are ready for all the matrix for nco nch and service level so now uh, just look there are some option available which is high point so if i will select high point the high point will be showcased similarly for the low point first point and the last point or we can showcase the markers so all the markers will be visible now okay so uh, we can showcase the markers similarly as we showcase it in the line graph okay so you also can change the spark line color like that okay so there are marker color also available so we will change the marker color as black so if i will remove all the things from there so i'll check only the high point so now i have to highlight the high point only okay and will change the high point color as green so now just look at the column g high point is visible now okay in the first in the last row if you will check the high point is 92 which is in the last now the last point is highlighted similarly in the second row similarly in the third one where in 120 is the highest second last okay then the second last point is highlighted so that is how you can use it so now how can we remove the spark line so select this and go to the design and go to the clear and clear selected spark lines okay so that is how you can clear it so now we will use the second option which is column select click on the column select the da uh, data range similarly and select the location range which is g2 so this is the column spark line okay so now just drag it down 
now it is looking like the column graph so here is option also available the same option high, high point low point first point last point negative points and the marker color like i am highlighting the marker color as the high so now high point is uh, showcasing in the green if i will change the value then the high point will be changed accordingly like that okay i put the 99 here then the high point will be between okay and you also can change the style which is available in the design you can change the sparkline color like that okay so the color will be changed so this option was the column option first was the line second column now i'm removing it clear selected spark lines and now the third option which is the bin loss app option so let me tell you how we can use the bin loss option select the range and the location same so just look at this now each bar are looking in the same position if i will change the number still this is the same this is not changing at all okay whatever is the number there now i'll tell you how we can use the bin loss and wherein we should use this so i'm taking the rent between minus 50 the bottom number to plus 50 okay positive 50 so now look at the spark line now so for bin loss naturally we will use for the positive and the negative number just change the style as green and red so wherein my data is negative the spark line is indicating the red and for positive it is focusing green okay so uh, friends this was the option to use the spark line in your dashboards or wherein you don't have the sufficient space to create the graph basically so it will not take the much space you can create it in the cell only and to indicating the trend or the column or the